that's the hot song Runaway from the debut album being released today by the Shadowboxers. And no, your eyes did not deceive you. That was indeed Justin Timberlake. The Say Something singer discovered the band in 2013 and has been mentoring them ever since. The Shadowboxers are even opening for JT on his tour. So how did these guys get their music in front of Justin in the first place? Well, it all started with a cover of Timberlake's own song, Push Your Love Girl. Yeah, yeah, I mean, I tweeted at him because that's what you do, you know. Hey, Jay Timberlake, we covered your song. Hope you dig it. Um, and for some reason, he saw it. Like, it was still kind of inexplicable. Uh, and then he tweeted that he liked the cover and reposted it. And then he sent us a direct message on Twitter, like... The next morning. Yeah, the next morning. And was like, how do I get in touch with you? And about a week... An agonizing week later, I uh, got a call from a Memphis area code and we talked for 45 minutes and a week after that he was in Atlanta on tour and he took us out to dinner. And in the, as the first meeting we, we bumped into him like in the hotel lobby and right as we got up to him Charles Barkley was like walking up the stairs so our introduction to him was just the two of them like rapping about a Lakers game mm -hmm. and we were just sort of like... <laughs> Okay, uh, and yeah. then and then he was just like, all right, you guys want to have a steak dinner? And like three minutes later, he, we were all just, it was like hanging out with a friend. While I'm still waiting for Justin to tweet me back, I think it's still going to happen. <laughs> I had to get the inside scoop on what working with the legendary suit and tie singer is really like. We would literally send him demos over email. He'd send back feedback or call us or text us and be like, Try putting, you know, this sort of slap back delay on this vocal. And then in the studio, he's extremely hands-on and wants to help us in every aspect of it, not just, you know, trying to open doors for us. Is he all business or is there some joking and stuff? It's definitely not. Totally not all business. Mm -hmm. our, our text thread with him is like 90% absurd and 10% business. <laughs> yeah. 